Hello, in this video I'm going to go over working with prefixes on the Casio FX CG50 graphing calculator. Prefixes are used in science to represent really big and really small numbers, and there's a nice summary of them here on the Wikipedia article, Metric Prefixes. Um, and of course you, you will probably end up remembering all of the really important ones here, uh, the ones that you use most often, but particularly in exam pressure, on the pressure of exams, you can forget, and sometimes it's nice to just have your calculator do it for you automatically. So if we click the option key in the run matrix mode, and then F6 and F1, we'll be brought to the convert menu. Uh, and I have a full video going over this menu, but we're going to have a quick look at it now. If you click F2 for length, you'll see we've got femtometer, micrometer, millimeter, centimeter, meter, and kilometer. And we can use this menu to convert between them and the other units here. However, it doesn't have all of these prefixes, of course, and also you can't use this in exam mode. So, that's n this isn't going to be the focus of this video, we're going to look at a different menu. If you click exit and then F6, and F1 for ENG-SYM, we'll get this menu. And here you can see uh, some more of the other prefixes that we have here. So, we have milli, um, micro, nano, pico, and femto. Um, and if we click F6 for the arrow, then on the other end, we've got kilo, mega, giga, terra, and peta. And if we click the arrow again, you'll see we also have exa. And then we've got um, these uh, buttons here, which we'll go over in a minute. So, pushing that to one side, you'll see that, um, so of course the conversion factor for milli is times 10 to the negative 3. And if we put in 1m, we of course get that. So, if we then click uh, the arrow, go to one of the big like prefixes. 5, uh, five mega. Of course, got the R6 uh, zeros following it. So you can use this to quickly convert between units automatically. But um, this menu has another feature as well. So what if we wanted this in standard form? Well, we can use these buttons to quickly put them into standard form. And then uh, change the, the uh, power 10 in both directions. So I hope you find this video useful. Uh, thank you.